What I'm working on at the moment, plastic recycling. I think that has a lot of purpose. I mean, when I talk to my daughter, she comes home and says, you know, there's more plastic than fish in the ocean. I want to be part of working on this and to be part of, you know, developing solutions for, for, for these issues. That's really motivating. That's, uh, that's what I enjoy. I'm literally living my dream. I'm actually doing the job that I aspired to do when I was a 19-year-old student. I felt that I wanted to work in industry because I felt if I could make a slight difference within a big chemical company or a big petrochemical company, then down the value chain that has very significant uh, impacts because chemistry enables 96% of all manufactured goods in the world. We absolutely believe that plastic is a resource that should not be wasted. We've seen the tremendous growth of plastic packaging over the years because it's extremely efficient. But we need to pay attention that it should only be used when it has the lowest environmental impact. We're moving away from a linear economy into a circular economy. So we, we've always been producing plastic, using plastic and disposing of plastic. And that's kind of been the end of the value chain. Without really designing with the end in mind and without designing for circularity. Traditionally we move from rigid to flexible due to energy efficiency meaning achieving the same with much, much less material. Now, you know that end of life is not the end of life. That's why it's been designed for recyclability using one type of material instead of two or three. Now we can use plastic and use it as a feedstock. We can actually take it back into new applications, we can take it back into an oil, and we can make this plastic industry circular, like many other industries. Circularity is about making chemicals again from, from plastics. Uh, so we are willing to invest to make it circular, meaning that it's not just a few plastic bags that we will take back, but that we are going to take back significant parts of the end-of-life plastics that are currently in the waste management system and avoid that it ends up in nature or in incineration. Waste management, collecting and sorting of plastics waste is not a core competency of Dow, and it, it never will be. Right? We're not a waste management company. But we do have a role to play in taking some of that plastics waste and incorporating it into products, whether it's via mechanical recycling or via feedstock recycling. We don't do it on our own. But having said that, we do have unique capabilities as a material science company that can actually contribute towards solving this problem and making plastics part of a circular economy. And I feel that what we're doing right now is moving in the right direction. Is it moving fast enough? Sometimes for me, no. But when I'm finished, I want to be able to look back and think I was part of a team that worked towards ending, or ending, I should say, plastics waste in the environment.